Yo, what's up guys? So, obviously from the title you know this is a different type of video than what I'm used to making. But, it's fine. I've been wanting to make this video for a long time now. And, this is my first time doing it. So, if I mess up doing this, then, well, yeah, just, you know, don't, like, get mad or anything. This I'm new to this. But, so for, I'll just start off with, um, some questions that people had and whatever in the past, even now, really. So, there were people wondering, why do I make videos with my friends? So, for a few different reasons, I make videos with my, with, eh, I make videos, sorry, I make videos with my friends for a few reasons. So, for reason number one, it's more fun entertaining for me and for you guys. And I feel like it's a lot easier to make videos with your friends, kind of. I actually, I think it's a lot harder, I don't know. I mean, personally, I find it easy. Or easier, sorry, it's not easy at all, but it's easier. And another reason is because I don't like being alone for videos. I feel like I'm too nervous and whatever when I'm alone. But when I'm with my friends and whatever, I get more confident and I build up that courage and all of that. And that's what I like is that when I'm friends with someone, I want to be able to be confident. I want to be myself. I want to be able to entertain people. I want to do all that. I want to, you know, be. F I want to be funny. I want to have jokes and whatever, or laughs with my friends, etc. And it's like that's what I get when I play with um, friends for and make videos with them. I get those laughs. I get those. Or sorry, I get that entertainment and all of that, and that's what I love. That's what I personally love as being a YouTuber and whatever. Obviously, I haven't posted in a long time because I haven't had time to really. And anytime I did, something would always come up or any something like that. Um, but another thing is, I feel like YouTube right now is in a state where there's a lot of problems going around so it's a lot harder to make youtube videos than it was back then and even now i mean it's still fun don't get me wrong it's still really fun but i feel like you get burnt out really easily and no i'm not burnt out or anything but i personally find it a lot harder to make videos now than previously but another thing is i, I don't count how many times I've said another thing. Um, but, I mean, since this is about me, I'm not going to go too into detail, obviously. But, that's mostly why I do videos with my friends. And, I'll just tell you a little more about me, and then we'll get into the next questions, and whatever. But, um, I am... Uh, 18 I will said 17 I'm 18 years old and you guys can just call me Tokyo why not I mean that's technically what I go by now really and the reason I chose that name was because I like I don't know I for, for stars I mean I like that I like the name I mean it, it's just, it, I don't I don't know, it, it just suits me a little more, I guess, but um, I also really like Japan and Tokyo and whatever, so that's kind of why I went for it, and that's where the inspiration came from for the username, and now I just kind of stick with it, um, so you guys can just call me Tokyo, but I, I play Roblox videos, obviously, or I make them or whatever and all that. I can't get it stuck here, jeez. Um, the part of me is wanting to switch from Roblox to other types of content. And I, I feel like I might be good at switching contents like from Roblox to like other games. 
but I feel like I'm not ready to take on that responsibility yet, which is why I keep doing Roblox. And I'm fine with Roblox. I love Roblox. I mean, it's, it's like there's a lot of good people and, and all that, and that they're the reason I do keep going and making videos on Roblox. Uh, otherwise, I would have quit a long time ago. And technically, what I don't know what else you guys should know about me. I know I'm kind of going through this a little quickly because I don't have long, so that's why I'm kind of switching, uh, you know, everything and whatever. But um, I I know there's people that actually here this is what my friend said so they, there is people there are people that can be rude and hate and yeah i've seen that before a lot i've had people hate on me before and one thing i've learned is as being a youtuber and in general just having friends or whatever that play with you in videos it's like who cares what people think? Who cares how many people hate on you? Because in reality, you have those friends that you can laugh with, you can play with, you can make videos with, which is the reason we, I started anyways. And you can have that joy and happiness because anyone can have that. Like, anyone can and obviously right now i'm not too good with words because you know i've never done this before but it's the truth and i know people I, as a youtuber i've seen people quit or get upset because people are hating and they just want to quit or whatever but the truth is it's like people are gonna hate people are gonna hate i don't now do i know why no they could they could have something going on in their life they could be just angry in general i mean i know how that feels to be angry to you know um to have that pain and whatever but you shouldn't have to worry about the hate because in general they're not going to stop you from what you want to do and you shouldn't let them stop you either because it's like if you let now it's happened to me before where i've gotten hate before and i just quitted youtube for a few months i think and i was like i didn't want to do youtube anymore because of it but after some time of thinking it's like I want to do this because this has always been my dream and I'm going to continue to do it whether I get hate or not. I mean, I get hate for my voice. I get hate for, you know, whatever. But it's like, I don't care. Like, I have friends that care. I have family that cares. I have, you know, everyone. So it's like, I don't care how people think and whatever. And my voice is definitely number one on why people, you know, hate and whatever for me. But it's like, I could care less, honestly. And you guys should care less to what people think. Because I know there's a lot of people that care and all that. Um, <clears throat> another thing is, I've had people come to me too, also. And asking for advice. Um on how to deal with it or whatever. Personally, if you want to deal with it, yeah, asking people for help is a good thing, but that's only 25% of what you should do. The other 75% has to be a, your doing. You have to, you have to lighten up. You have to, you have to find your happiness. You have to find your joy. You have to find, you have to do what makes you happy and don't, listen to what people say if people hate on you for example if people say you're not gonna accomplish this goal you're not gonna be anything then do what they like don't sorry that sounded that almost sounded wrong for a second but don't do what they say i mean use that hate that they give that they say to you and give you or whatever and use it against them be better be who you want for example, uh, if you want to be a YouTuber and someone says, oh, you're not going to make it as a YouTuber, but I'm just putting better words because I suck with words. But if someone wants, 
or hates on you for wanting to be a YouTuber and all that. It's like, if you think you can't do it, you will not accomplish anything. You will not do it. But if you know you can and you don't listen to them, then you will, you will be the happiest person ever because it'll be hard work, but eventually you'll get it to the point where you'll be successful. And trust me, I know that. I know how it feels to, you know, be let down, but I know how it feels to rise back up and come up from that. I mean, I've had a friend who wanted to be a doctor or whatever, and he got hate so much because he wasn't smart enough, and now he's literally a doctor. He's been a doctor for about three years now. And that is because he actually, he put in the work, he didn't, he took those hate that people gave him and he used it to his advantage and made it so he used that as a motivation. Use hate as motivation. Don't use it as something to cry over, to be sad over, because in reality, that hate is only temporary. It really is. It's only temporary. Everyone's going to get hate though. But hate doesn't last forever, and it's concurrent, but nobody can hate on you forever, and that's the truth. But I don't know what else to really say about me, because I mean, besides like what to call me and my age, I mean, I don't know. But I mean, I am planning on expanding my content though, when I get more into YouTube, I'm expanding my content from Roblox to other games and I may be I'm gonna be late to like these games like for example Doors 4 2 or this game that I'm playing right now I want to make a video on it and I'm going to but I want to make this video before anything because you know I've been waiting to post this and all that um I'm not gonna give you our personal information obviously but if you guys want to um, be in a video, because I, I hear a lot of people, uh, and I see a lot of people saying they want to collab or be in a video or whatever, you guys can. I mean, you just gotta let me know, and then I got you guys, because I want everyone to have an opportunity at having something good happen in their life, if that makes sense. And if you guys want to be in videos, I got you. Because, I mean, it's like anyone, um, anyone can be in my videos. It's like, even, even if I one day get 5 million subscribers or something or followers or whatever, even if I get that much, it's like, I'm still going to let you guys be in videos because it's like, I know there's YouTubers that, you know, um, don't really care or whatever I see a lot of people that do though a lot of youtubers that do care and let people be in their videos but I know a lot of people that secretly like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna expose anyone I'm not gonna save names but I've, I've met people that they're um, that make videos and whatever and they don't they get super annoyed when people are you know like in their videos or whatever but the truth is it's like it's not even a big deal sorry voice crack <laughs> uh it's not even a big deal but it's like why not you know have a chance at doing something good you know um and actually i do know another thing about me if you guys a lot of you know this obviously but another thing about me is the reason I became a YouTuber in the first place, you may think it's because of money or fame or whatever, but to be honest, I don't care about any of that. I think it's fun, but most of all, it's like when I one day do get um, a lot of subs, popular, whatever, it doesn't matter how much money I make, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna use that money for myself. Like, well, technically, I consider YouTube as a job kind of or just work so technically the money would be going to like you know a house and bills etc but um i mostly do youtube because i want to give back to people and entertain people and do all of that as you can probably see from my youtube bio if you look at it but 
I know a lot of people do it for money, but for me, it's like I want to be the per YouTuber that gives back to people. Like the people that, like for example, my friends or whatever. If they were to say, if they were strangers or whatever, I and all that, I, I would just. I don't know. It's I, I don't want to I don't want to say an example because I know I'm gonna make or mess it up or whatever or make it sound bad, at least you know. But I I want to give money to people. I want to give back to people. That's my whole goal, really. I mean, not you know, like I don't I I personally don't care for money, but. The only reason I possibly would care for money is just to give it to people, really. Because that's all I really care about, is just giving it to people and giving stuff to people. I mean, that's who I am, really. Just a giving type person. And obviously, like, people, there's people that definitely hate me, for sure, for a lot of reasons and all that. But I'm not the same person I was in the past. And even though you, I, it's okay if you think that I am, but I'm not, and that's the truth. I'm, YouTube has changed me a lot, my friends have changed me a lot, and even though I'm friends with a few toxic people, it's like they don't get in my head no more because I'm different now. I know how to not be manipulated, sorry, and I know how to not get my mind messed with me if that makes sense and it's like I the reason I am friends with toxic people is well I've just been friends with them for like so long and I, I hate it but at the same time I can't just ditch someone because then I'm the bad guy I feel bad if I do and I mean so far I mean they're getting they're getting better they're becoming a better person but the reason I'm so friends with them, another reason, sorry, another reason I'm so friends with them is because not only do I feel bad, but I personally think I can change people, not for the worse, but for the better. I personally think I can change them for the better. So, for example, if someone's toxic or whatever, I want to be nice to them and I want to change how they feel and their I want to change their perspective on the world and everybody and on everybody sorry um, and that's what I want to do that's that's another thing I, that's another reason why I do YouTube sorry because I want to make people happy I want to show people that anything's possible that you can always be happy and you know that that's what I want I don't know what else to really talk about, but I'll, I'll go through maybe two or three more things and then I'll call and I'll just be done with the video, I guess. But um, I also am live streaming um, later. I, I need I want to get back into that because I personally like live streaming because I can say hi to you guys and that's another thing I love being able to see you guys joining in and seeing how many people you know um join my streams i had a stream that i had over like i think 70 people joining in on at once or whatever that was actually that was actually pretty fun honestly and i mean just doing like tournaments and hosting events or giveaways for my discord server or for my stream that that also makes me happy because you guys I get to see you guys happy and all of that and it, it's fun because you guys can make friends with each other you guys can help each other it's like it's just so good it's so it's what I wanted this the whole like for live stream that's everything I wanted all in one and I want to keep doing that I sadly did take a break for a while because I was I got burnt out pretty fast and I don't have I lack motivation I can't take in motivation well like I can and can't it's hard for me to you know handle like 
it's hard for me to listen to motivation really not that it's not good it's just it's kind of hard for me to take it in you know what i mean if that makes sense and it's like i i do love this and i feel i feel like i need to definitely discipline myself more and um just keep making videos and live stream no matter what even if i don't want to i want to keep doing it because I want to do it for you guys, not ju not for my entertainment, not for fun. I want to do it for you guys because that's been my dream, and that's gonna it's gonna stay like that forever, no matter how many subs I have, no matter how many uh, followers I have, etc. It's like that's what I want. Why is it a floating piece of grass? <laughs> um, I do want to know what games you guys want to see me play though, like. It doesn't have to be it doesn't have to be roblox games it can be like actual games and i'll play it because that's why i want to expand my content and for like roblox if i make roblox content i want to focus on like one game and see how like and see how that does i know i did a car ride game back then and it went it went super viral and i I don't want to do cart ride though. It, it's not as fun anymore. No offense. The game, it, the game was fun. It just kind of, I played it so much, I, I got burnt out from it. And I wanted, I should have made more videos on it. I wish I did. If you guys want to see more cart ride, then let me know, and I, I, I'll gladly try to give it another shot. But for example, the game I'm playing right now, YouTube Legends or whatever, basically, um. I want to, for example, um, make content for just this game, like, I'm, and I'm talking like any game. I want to make content for like, I'm just, uh, sorry, <laughs> I'm giving an example. I just said that. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to be editing anything, so, because I want this to be like, you know, no, I, I want it to be true, like, no edited, nothing like that. So if I mess up, that's why. But I I feel like, for example, like if I make content off of this game, it might get repetitive and boring. But I want to be able to focus on one game and see how that game does for my channel, and then switch to another, see how that does. And I mean, that might be good for my channel, or it might be bad for my channel. I personally don't know, but I'm not going to be able to know unless I try, so I'm going to give it a shot. If it does not work out, I will do multi, multi? <laughs> I will do multiple different games, like Roblox. It can be like Roblox, Fortnite, Minecraft, GTA, um, whatever game you guys want. It'll be anything you guys want, Black Ops, or whatever. And I'll do it. I do still have a lot of learning to do as a YouTuber, so, you know. I, I have a long ways to go, but I mean with you guys, I mean, I know I can make it and you guys are the reason I even have over uh, 1k subs, almost 2k by the way, which is actually surreal for me and I love you guys, pause, <laughs> I love you guys though, you guys, are you guys are the reason I do this and you guys are the reason I'm happy doing this and I, I, I love this. Um, last thing though, before, you know, we end the video, because I know it's been, I think, over 20 minutes, um, I don't have school, by the way, so, if you guys think I don't post because I have school, I don't have it anymore, I've just been unmotivated, etc, but, um, vo can I stop having voice cracks? <laughs> um, I, I'll just go for like my favorite hobbies and sports I guess. My favorite hobby though is probably definitely making YouTube videos and you know playing video games obviously because I play video games for a living for YouTube, stream, but whatever you know. I mean it's, it's like my life and I'm good at it and I'm, not, I'm a natural at it some could say. <laughs> um, but another thing it's like I don't know what I was gonna say. <laughs> um, I, I do like doing this though, but right, yeah, 
I was just trying to remember what I was saying, but yeah. Uh, my favorite sport, I would have to say, is definitely soccer or um, ice hockey. To be honest, it's like I've always wanted to do ice hockey, and I'm gonna, I, I might try it honestly, because I feel like having a like something else uh, in my life, like a sport or whatever, would definitely help me keep or help me stay motivated for making YouTube videos and all of that, and. You know, that's going to help a lot. Plus, to be honest, I just kind of like ice hockey and soccer in general. Um, ice hockey, I know, is pretty difficult. Uh, soccer's decently easy, but difficult at the same time. And I like a challenge. So I'm probably going to go for soccer first. And then if I don't like it, I'll go for ice hockey. I mean, it's that simple. I mean, you know, whatever is fun. It's like... I'm not gonna do something I don't wanna do, you know? And it's, you shouldn't have to do something you don't wanna do. Even if people say, sorry, not, even, not say, if, even if people force you, it's like saying, oh, for example, uh, be, be a firefighter, firefighter, and you don't wanna be a firefighter or whatever, and you wanna say, you wanna be a YouTuber, then be a YouTuber, don't, like, don't worry about what other people say, be who you want, and, you know, be your own person, and I know this is more of, you know, talking to you guys instead of more an about me video, but, I mean, you know, I've been, I've also been kind of wanting to, like, talk about all this for a while now, so, I mean, it's really good I'm doing it either way and you guys do know about me if you i i do want to know some like if you guys have questions in the comments or whatever i'll answer them um but i do want to know your guys's opinion on like what videos i should film because i i, I need to know or i'll just try m multiple different things see how it works out i mean you know but i guess we can end the video there but um let me know if you guys have any questions, I'll answer them in the comments, and it can be anything if you want to know about me, let me know, just ask in the comments, etc, and I'll answer them, but I'll see you guys in the next video, if you, I don't know what I was going to say there, but I will be having probably two videos up. Besides this one, I'll be making a video on this game and doors, so that's just a little, like, you know, sneak peek, teaser, whatever you want to call it. Um, but, thank you guys for almost 2k subs, by the way, and uh, thank you for being the reason I st uh, keep going and do YouTube videos, so that, that I really love. I messed up my word choices, but I and sorry if I seem like shy, or nervous. I've never done this type of video, as I said, and I don't keep saying that. But you know that I'm just saying. <laughs> but um, I don't know how to do an outro. Uh, I usually do outros, but I don't know how to do an outro for this. But if you guys want to see. No, nope, I already said that. <laughs> I'll just I'll see you guys in the next video. Um and be ready for the next uploads, which will be later today or tomorrow. I know I said later today, but it depends how busy I am, I guess. Really? I I don't know. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.